Could a priceless painting actually be a copy? Mona Lisa, Da Vinci's mysterious masterpiece, is now being challenged by a younger rival. Her owners, of course, have millions of reasons to believe that their painting is the original. So ABC's Jeffrey Kaufman takes a close look so you can decide for yourself. Could it be the most famous painting in the world now has a twin? Mona Lisa, Leonardo's earlier version. That's what the owners of the so-called Eiselworth Mona Lisa told the world today. Hidden in a Swiss bank vault for almost half a century, it emerged accompanied by a stack of evidence meant to prove that this was Leonardo da Vinci's first version of this, a younger Mona Lisa. Note the perkier smile. The original has always been surrounded by intrigue, her eyes said to reveal a secret code or the artist's signature. But a second Mona Lisa? There are a lot of reasons to be suspect of this wannabe da Vinci. One of them, it only surfaced in Isleworth here in England in 1914. There is no record of its existence before then. And what does it add up to? Well, it adds up to being a, an interesting copy. An interesting copy. No more than that. There are many reasons to believe this is a copy by a lesser artist. First, the younger painting is on canvas. Leonardo painted on wood. The background on the younger Mona Lisa is, well, muddy, not like the masterpiece. But the real giveaway? Translucence. In the original, layers of light. They're just not there in the other one. And you look at them and you just go, wow. You look at that, that Mona Lisa and you go, ugh. A new Leonardo would be worth at least a hundred million dollars. But imagine, with only about 20 of his works in existence, how exciting it would be to discover one more. Jeffrey Kaufman, ABC News, Oxford.